Steve Popkeys is in no way bound to uh, Elizabeth Stafford at all because even though his wife died probably from the stress of him divorcing her and my mother uh, blackballing her and slandering her for so many years, uh, she died relatively young at the age of 61. And uh, there's a false sentimentality going on which Our Lady Good Success said would happen and end times with these deaths. A false sentimentality we can see going on with these fake obituaries that only smooth over <laughs> the lies that, uh, you know, Steve divorced her. She married a second time. I don't know if that was in the church or not. I'm sure Steve applying for an annulment only stressed her out more at the time and led to her, her um, unforeseen premature death. And the Archdiocese of Portland really is has blood on their hands in so many ways, and they just simply don't care. So I would exhort Steve Popkeys to forgive himself, uh, to go back to his late wife, Mary, in spirit. She's hopefully in purgatory or in heaven. Let's do, I would exhort him to do a Gregorian Mass, have a Gregorian Mass said for her soul. I'm thinking she's in purgatory. I don't yet think she's in heaven. I do believe that. I hope that she died in a state of grace. I hope that she was able to forgive my mother. And if she wasn't, I want to offer all my sufferings for that moment at her death because I personally know how hard it is to forgive my mother. And it would take a special act of super divine courage and grace on Mary Popkey's part to f completely forgive my mother for wrecking her marriage and basically destroying her life.